Yeah, what up, New York? We're headed towards the Brooklyn Bridge from the Brooklyn side, making our way into Manhattan. Let me show you how to do it. If you're off of Tillery, you can make your way to the Brooklyn Bridge. And you'll notice there's a lane for pedestrians, a lane for cyclists. And no matter what time of the day, evening, the Brooklyn Bridge is typically packed full of people. A lot of tourism, a lot of locals. A lot of people doing exercises. Some instances, depending on certain uh, events going on, you might see celebrities, protests, but a walk across the Brooklyn Bridge is always an event. I mean, you can see these people coming in through here, making their way from Manhattan. Or maybe they came from Brooklyn, walked halfway, and then came back. I'm going to record the whole experience in one go. See how long it takes me to get from here to Manhattan. Very good costume for it. I'm taking these shots while I'm out. I'm losing light, but... I'm gonna see if I'm able to capture something interesting on the bridge. This isn't the only way you can make your way to the bridge. There's other ways. If you're coming in from Dumbo or Pebble Beach. There are some ways. The area we're going through, the promenade, it's uh, looks like the cyclists go to the very far right. But this used to be a cycle lane. It's like they got rid of it. Oh. Now, one of the things that I did see before moving out here is I, I wanted to see what the etiquette was of, you know, taking photos, walking around the city. One of the biggest problems that I've seen just from the videos that I, I looked up was that there are a lot of cyclists that make their way through the bridge and there is a bike lane dedicated for those cyclists, right? I, th I think sometimes the tourism, people that just get into the moments of taking photos are, at, uh, are, are not aware so they make their way into the bike lane really I guess upsetting a lot of bicyclists trying to make their way through here either through exercise or on their way to work whatever totally get that frustration but it looks like now I don't know I haven't seen this in a while they have like a dedicated bike lane to the far right. And the street vendors are out here selling trinkets, souvenirs, you know, New York license plates, hoodies, beanies, t-shirts on both ends from the Brooklyn and the Manhattan side.
but yeah you can see up ahead the mass amount of people just it's a busy day it's Christmas Eve and I think a lot of people are out here trying to get for the holidays trying to get their photos of the bridge it's super crowded think about the Williamsburg Bridge think about the Manhattan Bridge that we photographed and walked through this month the Brooklyn Bridge is always like this typically and especially even more so now during the holidays I mean, look at that you're not going to get through that without bumping into somebody so maybe you make the best of it get some uh, make take the opportunity to get some photos of people doing crazy shit Yeah, they also got churros over here too. You gotta master the sidestep when you're in New York. Looks like we got through that first wave, but still a lot more to go. Now that we passed the concrete, I guess it's the official entrance to the Brooklyn Bridge here where it turns into wood. Yeah, it's going to be impossible to get some shots without anybody in here, so. If you're wondering when the best time to come out here, because there's not a lot of people, it's super early. I'm talking about like 6 a.m., 5 a.m., and then late at night, like after 10. Ooh, you can smell the weed. get on these things and take photos like risking getting knocked over into traffic
sidestep and get some pretty interesting views of the Manhattan Bridge on the east side of the Earthland Bridge. And then of course to the left, west side of the bridge, you get all the city views. And then look, you can actually see the traffic. And there's some really cool opportunities to get some photos of the traffic and the bridge, you know? Probably more so like if there's yellow cabs, it'll bring out the, the photos a little bit better. But I haven't seen too many of the yellow cabs, only these modern cash cab looking things. Like that one. Well, what else? You could probably do some shutter tricks here to make that traffic, you know, steam off, look like blurred lines. See, like that's cool. kind of cool be cautious not to drop my shit You want me to take a picture? Yeah, absolutely. Of both y'all? Yeah. Alright. Cool. Oh. Like vertical or this way? Yeah, vertical. Okay. Alright. There you go. You. Have a good one. Going against traffic over here. <laughs> what the fuck? Did it look? Oh, that's kind of cool. So what's up? So I'm going to take a of starting drafts. Yeah, that's cool. Thank you. Which way? Yeah. It's that's it, alright. That guy's in the way zone. There you go. Thanks. Thank Have you. Just the guy with the camera. <laughs> okay. I gotta get the hell out of here. Oh, that's cool. Now, if you look to the right, east of the Brooklyn Bridge, if you're walking towards Manhattan, um, you get some pre pretty good views of the Manhattan Bridge. You like that kind of stuff. And you got the traffic. Underneath here, you can see the, uh, the ice rink. I'm gonna see if I can get that. They got the a Zambigo, or what the hell is that called, that cleans the ice? Zamboni. 
I can't see how I did it. I'm gonna wait till it goes around. The Zamboni. It can't be that big of a ice rink, but it should come around here shortly. That'd be cool to get it in the shot, but I'm not holding my breath. Where you at, Zamboni? Oh, oh, here it comes. Alright, cool. Oh, that'll do. A lot of uh, there's a lot of math going on up in here with this grid. If you're into that stuff, oh sweet! Brooklyn Bridge, which is erected by the cities of New York and Brooklyn. Oh, shit. There's a helicopter just hovering around. It's getting dark. So it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. It's 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 packed, but it's not as as crowded as I would imagine it to be during Christmas Eve.
You. Yeah. I think I got it. So as you can tell, the bridge just got a lot more activity. It's a lot, I think it's more beautiful than the other bridges. I think it's probably the more popular bridge that people tend to cross. Um, and you got like great views of both sides of uh, east, west, I mean all of you, all, all around really. That's a pretty good one. You look fresh, man. Thank you. What the fuck? I forgot about the, the locks. So you have like a lock problem and you get like a hundred dollar fine. I don't know what the lock situation is, but it makes for a pretty decent picture and it's probably annoying to the people who have to remove them. get the New York skyline to the left to the west you get a little bit of visual of the Statue of Liberty dark enough now to get some uh, light streaks from the traffic and we'll get a shot set up down here. Huh. 
yeah, every five seconds you hear those vendors with the 360 things, you're, you're bound to hear that New York song over and over and over and over again. The Empire State of Mind, it's, it's all right, but it sucks you have to keep muting it during the video. Now, I've been out here taking photos of this bridge for lots of times. The best time to come out, no lie, is early morning, five o'clock. Sometimes there's steam, fog, mist, all that shit that adds that creepy ambience to the photo. And you're up early enough, you can capture it and there's nobody around. And when the lights are on, it looks even trippier. There's Pier 17, right over there. They got some pretty cool shops and restaurants. You can go in there in case you're wondering what that is. Oh, you can buy art. My homies with the art, New York. All right, let's see if I can get this shot again. See if I can get a, a streak. The yellow cabs. I right, take my glasses off. I'm starting to see everything in yellow. Alright, let's see if I can get this shot. And the streak. Focal point down there. Bam! All right, I'm gonna have to duck down. Can I do this? Oh yeah! I get a yellow cab in there. Where the yellow cabs at? <sighs> Look at that traffic's moving really slow. Well, I'm not gonna get it through here. Ooh, the churros. 
Let's pack now. We're about to head into Manhattan. Yeah, look at all the vendors. Selling everything but beer. I'm gonna kind of chill right here. Try and get a good shot. Somebody walking across. Oh, it wasn't that bad. Somebody leaving their shit on the ground is not a good idea around here. Somebody could pick it up, like, quickly. Don't do that. Sorry. <laughs> oh, there's my homie. He's usually in, in Times Square. You know, he's out here making some cash. Look at that. You're gonna love one another. My homie over there doesn't like it when I'm creeping around the shoulder taking photos. Give me a dirty chapulín look. We definitely lost all the light we were ever going to get on the bridge. <laughs> Oof, look at this pack. It's congested right here. Uh, I wouldn't know about this. I don't know about doing that. The lady's fucking insane. She's crazy. Yeah, I'm going to see. People climb on these little areas thinking they're safe. And 
I don't know about letting kids get on here, but like, I mean, look how far, like how easy it is to just straight up fall down into traffic and you're screwed. I mean, look how crazy. <laughs> yeah. uh, that's their parents. We got a DJ. Oh shit, we got a DJ spinning. We got some light now on the bridge. Let's get some people. And So, my battery ran out during one of those photo shots, photo ops that I took. Hopefully I got the video leading up to it. All right, we're nearly the end of the bridge into Manhattan.
Let me know. Look this way. Which way? This way? Uh, <laughs> Thanks, man. about calling it towards the end here. Some of the vendors are packing up. So you get a little bit of midday to evening video here of the Brooklyn Bridge. That's what it looks like facing all the madness. Look at all this fucking trash. Brought to you by your fellow tourists, maybe, maybe the locals too. Beautiful. I think one of the funniest things about like when you see people taking photos in groups, you show up with a camera as they're getting their shots taken by a phone. If you take that shot, you'll notice that a few people will look towards the actual camera. A few others will look towards the phone. It's like, where do I look? It's an instinct, I think. just a few yards away into Manhattan off of the bridge onto the promenade and making our way into Manhattan Aww. shout out to Bones at the Bones show for coining that name 
Manhattan. If you haven't seen the Bone Show, you gotta check it out. It's on one of my videos. That looks kind of cool. It's a nice little photo op right there if you get the right patience, the right crowd. The baby's like saying, what up? Yeah, so we're at the end of the Brooklyn Bridge now. One dollar, one dollar, one dollar. Dollar water, dollar water, dollar water, one dollar for the water, one dollar for the water. One dollar for the water, one dollar for the water. That concludes the Brooklyn Bridge tour of midday to the evening walk. I don't know, all the picture opportunities it's good for street photography um, I didn't I don't think it took very long to get across but thanks for joining me on that as always my photos that I take on these street walks can be found in the description on pixie set so if there's any photos that you like if you want to get a print go to the link in the description it'll take you right to the store you get any of the photos printed to any size that you want high quality go get some also don't forget to like comment and subscribe go to my uh, Instagram Moera New York and if you have any suggestions on what you want to see next out here in NYC Brooklyn or any of the other boroughs hit me up with some suggestions in the comments. All right, guys. Peace.